Hi, so in this video I'm going to show you how to change a day look into an evening look if you're in a hurry or you want to go out after work or, or just want a quick look for your evening, for your night out. So I've already got my day look on, so instead of redoing it all again, there's, there's no need to. Your foundation is fine, everything else is fine, you just want to change it up slightly to make it a little bit smokier maybe for your nighttime look or just to touch up a little bit. So I'm gonna start off with my eyes. So what I tend to do when I'm going out and I already have my makeup done from the day is I'll get um, a liner. Now, you can get any type of liner. I like this particular one, it's a little plumber one, but it has a little felt tip. Just because it's handy and it's quick. So I'll start then by just, I'll start in the middle. and just follow the lash line. So if you're doing like a winged liner, you can be more precise if you want to. What I tend to do when I'm in a hurry the winged liner sometimes can take a bit of time. Is I'll pop it on like that. I'll get my little brown, like a dark brown shadow. And I'll actually just buff that out. It just darkens it up a little bit. I should get my mirror. Smoke it out a little bit more. I'm literally bringing it along where I put the liner. Just getting a smaller brush now, just to bring it in to this inner corner rather than using the big fluffy brush. And you have no control over it then with the fluffy brush. So it's a bit smokier. And then I'll grab my eye brush and go for a little bit of a warmer brown. Still keeping it a little bit darker. But not as dark as what I put on the lash line. Just make sure that it's blended. So it's just a little bit darker but not too dark. <clears throat> so I'm just gonna do that on the other eye as well. So I'm going with my big fluffy brush and my, see it's kind of a warm brown, it's right here. And into that kind of crease area again. So again, I do most of my eyeshadow with my eyes open because I have that hooded lid right there. Because if I do my eyeshadow with my eyes closed, I don't know where I'm placing it, open it up and it can be gone. So doing it with my eyes open, at least you see where you're putting it. So we're just gonna go back into like that bone color, just to blend the edge a little bit. A little bit of warmth and a transition color, an orangey color. Very similar to bronze color into the bone colour just to blend that edge. So that's pretty much it on the top lash. So then for the bottom waterline you can run your black all the way along. again into the dark brown and just blend that slightly kind of sets that as well and it's absolutely fine to put a little bit of the powder on your waterline it sets your liner I'll often use a gel liner as well which is probably my favorite for longevity once that's done, 
get a little bit of bronzer and I'll literally blend that out underneath. And that's pretty much it for the eyes. So once again, if you want to curl your lashes, I'll give them a little curl over very slightly because you've already got mascara on. Just add one more coat. It's literally just to freshen up. <clears throat> That's all it is. Because you put darker eyeshadow on, a little bit more mascara is sometimes needed. Now I'm just getting a clean brush and brushing away anything that fell down there. placing that down and I've done this before where I just put down a little bit more foundation over my original foundation earlier in the day once I blend it out it's absolutely fine powder just to reset that again then maybe a little bit more bronzer or you can go ahead and contour if you wish just to darken it a little bit this little flat brush some bronzer on it also just down the sides of the nose just create a shadow on either side and blend it out the same brush under the jawline and blend that out as well blush I'm literally just topping up for my night time back in with some highlight to blend it loads just to make sure everything is blended together so that's a quick little eye look for going out and then really to make the difference I suppose and make it look like a, an even look is to add a pop of colour to the lips so I'm just going to go with like a, a pink a deep pink For an example, you could do a red, a burgundy, whatever you want. Just 
tidy up any edges of the lip liner. And that's really it. You can top up the eyebrows if you want to. I'm just going to leave them. Then you can do whatever, go get changed, do something different with your hair. Depends on how much time you have after work or when you're in a hurry. Okay, hope you enjoyed that. See you in the next one.